The VMAs are one of the four major American popular music awards and Blackpink will be the first K-pop girl group to appear on this stage. They are also the fourth girl group overall to perform after TLC, Spice Girls, and Fifth Harmony. For her self-titled track, La Lisa, Blackpink member Lisa is also nominated in the Best K-Pop category as the first-ever solo female K-Pop star and Korean soloist. The voting for the VMAs ends on August 20th, and fans are actively voting for Lisa, so she can make history, for being the first and only K-pop soloist to perform and win an award in VMAs, that would be a history of histories. However, there was controversy among Blackpink fans about Blackpink's performance as well as Lisa's solo performance at this music event. Some people say it makes no sense if Blackpink could perform the song not nominated on that award instead of the song who's nominated there. Many people think that if Blackpink took advantage of AI nomination to promote a not yet published song, Blink's denying Lisa's right to have her own stage is inappropriate. Many point out that when Blackpink as a group invited to Coachella, YG said a member needs to perform her solo on a group activity under a group invite. But why doesn't that happen at VMAs? In Coachella, Jenny got to perform solo even though she's not invited as a soloist and instead used the group to promote herself. However, there are views that Coachella was a whole Blackpink concert and they got time slot of one hour, so it's understand that YG chose to let Jenny perform her solo instead of the other song. Whereas VMAs are an award ceremony and they have only three or four minutes, so they will prioritize performing their songs. However some people still think it'll not make any sense if Lisa doesn't perform. They think she'll get to perform only one song and joined by members later. What do you think about this?